we were brought up loving our country and our constitution. And in the United States of America, we were free. And that's an attitude that we've tried to instill in our children. I met my wife while uh, in the Air Force. I was a combat pilot in Vietnam. I served in Desert Storm as a commander. When I graduated from the academy, I took the oath of office. Uh, and as a commander, I administered that oath to many people. Now I, I wonder about the understanding people have of our Constitution, and I think about our candidates for President of the United States. Uh, it's interesting to see the support Ron Paul gets from the military. And if we think back to the code of conduct, uh, and people raising their right hand that they were going to support and defend the Constitution of the United States. Why would those same people support in great numbers on Paul? I think it's because they know that he supports the Constitution of the United States. It doesn't mean you have to go to war to do it. Uh, it means you have to understand what the Constitution is and be a supporter inside of your own country, whether you're in the military or not, of that Constitution and make the United States strong. And Ron Paul does that. That's his feeling. That's his thrust. And that's why if you look at the percentages that support him and the military, it's huge. Why is that? Because they've raised their right hands and they're putting their lives on the line for us here in the United States. And they know that Ron Paul does the same.